Yo, what's up, guys? It's Monk Styles. Thank you guys for tuning in. I will be showing you guys my personal best class setup in Battlefield 4. So, I hope you guys will enjoy it. And before we jump into it, uh, if you guys did miss my previous videos of today, my plan for zombies and the important one, the giveaway, the links of the videos will be in the description down below. So, yeah, so you guys can check it out yourself. And now, let's jump into it. I'm using the AK-12, it's my personal favorite gun, it's the best looking gun. So I'm using the Coyote RDS Optic, it's just a square reflex sight for me. It's just, it seems the normal reflex sight to me. You have the official called reflex sight, but it's a circle reflex sight, it will not give you a good sight on the enemies. So I'll be using the Coyote RDS, it will give you a lot better sight on the enemies. The second attachment, you have the canted iron sight or the magnifier, but why shall we pick that? It will slow your, uh, slow your weapon up, so we don't want to have that happen. The flashlight, tactical light, it doesn't even make sense why you shall pick that. You have the laser sight and the green laser sight. I want the green laser sight, but I didn't unlock it yet, but there is no difference between them. So I will be using the, uh, the normal laser sight, the red one. And the barrel, I'll be using the muzzle brake barrel, it gives me a lot more stability on the weapon and we want more stability on the weapon, so I'll be using that. Under barrel, the ugly, I will call it ugly rail, it's, it doesn't make sense why you should pick that. If you if you are a camper, if you have an engineer class setup, you can pick that, it will give you a, it give you something, uh, something good. The bipod, this is the, this is the best thing best thing for the campus you can uh, put your weapon uh, everywhere and uh, and just lay on the ground and uh, wait to uh, wait till you can fuck up some uh, people and uh, but I'm using the anglet grip it gives me the extra boost of stability and I want some more stability on my weapon that's the most important thing for me and the paint camo also camo flush why shall we pick that it's just uh, something that makes your weapon cool, uh, looks cooler. <laughs> God damn it! Yeah, it's just something that makes your weapon look cooler. So it doesn't make sense what it will do to your weapon. So, but I'm well using the uh, Grimson Woodland and Woodland. Oh, this I am. Okay, and for the secondary weapon, I didn't look anything at all. But I'm not using the secondary weapon at all. But if I'm if I'm reloading my primary weapon and I'm shooting on an enemy, I want to finish it and I will pick my my secondary weapon. So that's the that's the thing why, when I'm using the secondary weapon. But like in the game, I will never use my secondary weapon. Why should I do that? It's it's the it's the worst thing you can do. Gadget one, you always if you if you have a assault class setup, you always pick the medic back because you can you can just if you got shot, you can just refill your heals. Why should you pick the first aid pack if it's it's a single use medic pack? Just the same thing as the medic pack, but it's a single use thing. So why should you pick that? I always use the medic pack. You can use the defibrillator. I can't even speak it out, but it's for reviving your uh, reviving your teammates. So yeah, if you are a team uh, player, you can uh, pick the defibrillator. I can't speak it out, guys. But I will be using the medic bag and gadget too. I will be using the M26 frag. It shoots uh, frag grenades. We don't want that. We want to sh blow up some fuckers. So we will pick that grenades. It's just uh, it's just something you guys need to choose yourself. It it don't matter which which one you pick. But I I like the incendiary uh, grenade. It's a uh, it's a grenade which creates a cloud of intense burning particles for a short duration. Particles stick to the soldiers and will continue to burn outside the original fire. So I'll be using that, it's, uh, it's the best grenade for me. And the knife, I didn't look at anything at all, but this, this one, the machete, I want that. But we didn't uh, unlock it yet, if I, I'm playing the campaign, I will unlock it. 
so for now i will be using the acb 90 it's uh i did unlock it i don't know how i did unlock it but i did unlock it and the most important thing of all you need to have uh, a field upgrade that fits your play style and i'm not a defensive player i'm not going to camp and uh, wait for enemies to come to kill me so i will never use defensive uh, upgrades never shadow why the hell should i pick it come back combat uh, made medic if you are a team player you will pick that it will be uh, your game uh, game style and grenadier if you want to blow up some motherfuckers you can pick that but my personal field upgrade my my thing that works out for me the best is the offensive um, offensive field upgrade is the is the upgrade that fits my playstyle the sprint increase maximum sprint by speed speed by 10 percent ammo increase maximum inventory of bullets by 50 percent grenades increase maximum inventory of hand grenades by one reduce fall increase heights you can fall without damage so that's the thing i want so i'll be using that and the camo flash is just the same thing as the weapon camo it doesn't even make sense it uh, it doesn't affect your gameplay so i'll be using the vine leaf because i i think that's the best looking uh, camo flash i have but i want chocolate chip chocolate chip but i will be using the vine leaf okay let's uh let's jump into the game i will be playing the death range to show you guys my weapon the stability is really great really great a little bit shit, a little bit shit. come on and you have the the secondary weapon why shall we pick that it's just it's just bullshit i i'm i'm wondering how how far i can shoot oh i got it first hit okay that's good and the the frag this thing is awesome L let's let's see what i can do i love this i love this look guys look guys what not even i didn't even blow up the wall oh shit okay okay awesome 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 let's let's blow up the fucking squad still alive are you still alive are you still alive what the fuck is happening he's indefeatable indefeatable so yeah let me know what you guys think about this uh class setup if you guys did try it yourself if you guys want to see more so yeah let me know and like always don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and i will see you guys later